Wow, Cancer. This is going to be a reading for Cancer. Whoa. Death in the world, okay? Y'all could definitely be dealing with a Scorpio, but um, a definite ending here, okay? The song that came up for y'all is Beautiful People by Ed Sheeran featuring uh, Khalid, Khalid, okay? All right, what else for Cancer? Okay, two of one. So I feel like for you guys, what came to what came to an end was a goal that you had in the past okay what else and the song if you listen to the song it kind of sounds like somebody in the past was feeling like appearances matter all this all these things matter but now they're starting to feel differently so cancer cross watcher or anybody who is um drawn to the title or the the card that I put on the thumbnail of this video or whatever the reason was, okay? 52 or 25 could be significant. Like that could have been how old you were when you met somebody, how long you guys been together, anything like that. It could be uh, you were born on the second, on the fifth month or anything. But if you gotta think about it too hard, that probably just don't mean anything for you, okay? What else for cancer, okay? All right, you guys, Um, you could have been definitely dealing with uh, a Leo, Aries, or Sagittarius here. Um, In the past, somebody was very passionate. Uh, probably, you know, might have been a little uh, promiscuous, okay, you guys? In the past, and I feel like maybe that's coming to an end for you. Hmm. Maybe appearances matter to you a lot in the used to be okay aries energy here again with the tower coming out something happened something happened here what is this tower something happened to change the way you feel about things like appearances and stuff like that wow <clears throat> you guys might have lost somebody recently like physically like somebody might have passed if so, they might come through the reading with a message. That usually means like, I might not know what that message is, but you might. Okay, so, oh, well shoot, I moved, moved them over too far. Okay, let me see if that'll work. I actually, oh yeah, I've been meaning to start turning my camera like that. I'll do it the next time, you guys. Okay, so, what else for Cancer? What else for Cancer? The Ace of Wands. Okay, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. So, what's going on is something happened and it sparked like a new... It changed the way you felt about things, I think. Or I feel like, yeah. So, you guys might have lost somebody. And it changed the way you think and looked at everything. What else for Cancer? Knight of Cups. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. It changed the way you felt about love and passion. It changed the way you felt about... Maybe in the past you felt like somebody's looks was very important to you, but now it doesn't matter as much. Or something like that. That's what I'm getting from that song, okay? Take My Breath. The Weekend. Okay, that's wild. Because I said somebody take my breath the weekend you guys be careful this weekend because i'm not liking this take my breath and okay the um death and the ten of swords like i said can be physical death so be careful what you ingest this weekend be careful what you do this weekend cancer okay hell no everything is fine be careful what you do this weekend cancer somebody could be strategizing okay Queen of Wands, you're very beautiful. Um, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. Somebody could be watching you online here with the world and the Two of Wands. And I don't like uh, where this is going. Okay, let's... Two of Wands, this person's got a goal. What is this person's goal for cancer? What is this person... Okay, so now we do have a match here. King and Queen of Wands. But everything else has got me weirded out. Okay, so. <laughs> wow. 
what is the uh, goal of this person as far as cancer is concerned? They want to make you happy? Okay. Now this is... Okay, you know what this is giving me? That this person uh, was waiting on something else to end before... Oh, Lord, I got my junk in the background. Yeah, excuse me. That's, that's my little... Uh, that's my little sage, palo santo, incense, all that stuff. Um, but yeah, you guys. So I feel like this person was actually waiting on you to maybe break up with somebody or waiting on a relationship to end, either your relationship or their relationship. This person was waiting on it to die, okay? So this wasn't an actual probably physical death here. This person was waiting on your relationship to end. Five, five, five on the clock. Now that's interesting, okay? This person feels like you you are their match. Very passionate about you, okay? Like I said, with the world card, the way the world card was sitting beside that particular two of wands, I feel like this person was watching you online somewhere. Okay, what else for cancer? These two five of swords here, I'm getting strategizing. This person is ready to win at all cost for you, Cancer. They made up their minds. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Hmm. Whoa. They made up their mind, Cancer. <laughs> there is no other option besides success here. Victory with the Six of Wands card. Uh, temperance energy. Sagittarius. Okay. Balance. This person wants to bring balance to your life, Cancer. Cross watcher or person who, you know, uh, resonate with the title or this popped up in your feed. This could be for you because you'll see I'm calling out all these signs that this could be for. So, I believe this is a lot of fire energy here. So, you definitely could be a fire sign, another water sign, or an air sign. I don't know if I've seen any earth yet. Okay. Page of Wands. Uh, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. So, this is a lot of... um. Yeah, this is a lot of uh, fire energy here. This person was waiting for this other relationship to end, though, before they came forward with their stick here. <laughs> then they found out it was over, and it was like, here I am with my stick, my wand, whatever you want to call it. My me. Okay, so I meant to split that upside down for the... Mm -hmm. Now, some of these came out in the Scorpio reading. So, 7.47 on the clock. Like, this person... You or this person was tied up in a, a home or family situation before. And, you know, I feel like they were waiting for you to kind of move out of this choppy waters you were in. So, I don't know if you know this person was already watching you. But I feel like they were. Okay. Judgment. So that was their judgment call was they were waiting for this relationship you were in to end before they came forward with their offer of love. Okay, which that's cool. Cancer Pisces Scorpio. You could be younger. They could be younger. Old. You know there could be an age difference here. Um, with the Eight of Pentacles and the Magician Gemini Virgo energy. Um, the Eight of Coins. This person is a a hardworking person that you could work with them maybe. Okay, I don't like this. This was at the bottom of the deck. I'm going to put it back in, though. All right, what else? Ooh, okay, that could be a Capricorn. Uh, but <laughs> maybe they're afraid of you. Okay, let's see what else for Cancer. Hmm. Queen of Cups with the Ace of Wands. Okay, so... Yeah, let's just be careful with this person because I see a lot of uh, wands here. What about cups? Okay. Well, you, I mean, you might not know them very well yet. So, you know, that could explain why there's a lot of passion but not a lot of cups yet because you at least need to... Because if you just start telling somebody you love them, you don't even know them. That's kind of love bombing. <laughs> so, yeah. Gemini energy, the lovers here, this person might be a little afraid of you. Or they could be a little toxic. I'm going to be honest. You could be a little toxic. They could be a little toxic. We do have two ace of wands here. <laughs> so, yeah, maybe y'all work on your toxic behaviors together. I don't know. We'll see here. 
what else the page of swords they're definitely watching here gemini libra aquarius uh you could have a kid it could even be an air sign kid not necessarily though the moon the moon and the lovers okay gemini um cancer pisces interesting you could have met or talked to this person on this recent um full pink moon that we had recently okay down in the rabbit hole you go here <laughs> okay what else King of Wands, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. What else? Anything that Cancer needs to know about this person that's had their eye on them. What else do they need to know? Okay. This person wants to be, I feel like they want to be truthful about you. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Energy, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Energy. They want to be truthful with you about something. Um, or what they want to bring to you is love and truth. I feel like respect. Okay, they don't want to miss an opportunity with you here, okay? This Four of Cups is missed opportunity. They do not want to miss an opportunity with you here. Okay, um, then we got two twos because the High Priestess is the two and then the Two of Cups. This person feels like you could definitely be like a um, like their soulmate or something like that, okay? So, uh, Taurus, Virgo, Cancer, Pisces, Energy, but this person, they definitely want to, you know, tangle up, okay? So... <laughs> The high priest is coming up. Let's see. Um, did we have it? anything else that... Okay. So, Empress on the bottom of the deck. I was about to say, is there anything else that... Yeah. Let me see something. Is there anything else that Cancer needs to know about this person? Is Are they hiding something? Is that why the moon came out? What is this person hiding from Cancer? Or what does Cancer need to know about this person? The Four of Swords and the Five of Wands. When I say, what does this Cancer need to know about this person and the Four of Swords comes up? I say definitely uh, get them tested first because the Four of Swords can be sick um, and it can be stuck. So it can be that they're stuck in a relationship, you know? Okay, but 45 or 54 could be significant. What is this um, Five of Wands and this Four of Swords for this person? Leo energy um strength. Okay. What is this? What is this? The will of fate. This reminds me of twins. Definitely could be a Gemini. Um three of wands. This person is waiting on something. Waiting on a page of wands and a page of cups. Hmm. Maybe some situation with uh some kids. So they could be kind of stuck with a situation, something to do, a situation with some kids. So they're waiting on, so they could be waiting on something to play out with a baby mama or something. Because I did see the Empress on the bottom of the deck. Okay, what else? What else? Page of Pentacles definitely could be, you know, ooh, yeah. I feel like they could be married. And if they're not married, they just probably are in a serious relationship with the mother of their child here. She could be a Taurus, a Virgo, or a Capricorn. Um, okay, so what else? She could have two to three children by this person. Three, possibly, with this Three of Cups popping up after I said that. Okay, but this person is kind of tied in with this baby mama because they got a three of cups here. So it could, you know, that don't necessarily mean nothing. I mean, you know, people have got kids, but what it means is, is that this person here is not going to easily let them go. Okay. This, this uh, feminine energy here, ooh. Okay, she could be an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, but I feel like with this moon here, two of swords, sometimes there's like a blindfold over her eyes, so maybe she don't know what's going on, point blank, period. Or 
she could be in the midst of making a choice to, you know, you know, maybe she's got her own things going on that he don't know about. If this is, you know, just put the put the sex or the, you know, whatever where it needs to be, okay? Because the energies can always be flipped, like I try to tell y'all all the time. But yeah, there's definitely some. Okay, so this could also represent like two different baby mamas, or you know, something like that. Or daddies, if you're if you're the man here, or you know, like I said, flip it where it needs to go. But something's got this person stuck here with the hanging man, Pisces energy, or maybe it's you. You know, maybe you're the one that's got the blockage. Okay, Cancer could be Eight of Cups. Okay, you could have walked walked away recently from somebody, or they could have. Okay, so Eight of Cups, and then the hanging man is kind of crazy because it's like. When when these okay when these first came out I thought it's giving mental problems N not mental problems but it could be anything like depression bipolar or something like that but I feel like that one of the feminine energies this person is dealing with has got something like that going on almost to the point where they're scared of them I don't know <laughs> that's what I'm getting okay um. So, it's like the Eight of Cups and the Hangman, it's like they did walk away from this person, but they're still stuck with them. I know that don't make sense, but it might if this is your story. Or this person still tries to hold on to them or something like that. Yeah, what else for Cancer? Well, a lot tried to fall out. What else for Cancer? What else for Cancer? You guys, if the reading resonates and you want to get a personal, because remember, these are general readings, so take what resonates, leave the rest. Okay, so King of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. <laughs> oh, they want to come straight for you, Cancer. This is your energy here. This is theirs. I did a reading a couple weeks ago where I was saying, uh, this was on either Instagram, I think it might have been Instagram or TikTok one, and it was uh, you caught the eye of a very um, powerful masculine energy. I'm kind of getting that feeling because it was this, this was one of the ones and I was like, uh, it's almost creepy because it almost feels like the person is like creeping from behind the bushes. Oh, remember, wait. Now, there was a, the Queen of Pentacles has that rabbit too. Okay, the moon Hmm. And I saw 747 on the clock. Okay. So the moon. Okay, so this is your energy, Cancer. Cancer Pisces energy. Maybe maybe you're keeping somebody a secret here. This King of Pentacles, maybe. Hmm. Okay, Cancer. Anything else for Cancer? Or keeping a secret from this King of Pentacles, possibly? Anything else for Cancer? Seven of Wands. Oh. Okay. So what I'm getting here for you, Cancer, is that possibly what's blocking this connection is a, a baby daddy or baby mama or something. Okay. So what this could be, it's either an earth sign's blocking this connection, a spouse, a baby mama or father, or a parent. That's what all that could be. Okay, 10, not 10, the world. So this person doesn't want things to end. So this could be on your side, Cancer, or the other person's side. There's there's a parent of a child who does not want to let go. King of Cups, they're like all in their emotions. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Or that's just your energy. They don't want to let you go. Nine of Wands. Yeah, this person is 97 or 79. Could be significant. But this person doesn't want to let go of this cycle with you. They don't want the cycle to end. Okay, even though I feel like you've made a choice to end it. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Energy, Cancer, please. Spirit, anything else for Cancer? Let me get another song for you. Or did I get a song for you? Oh, yeah, I did. Let me get one more. Oh, yeah, take my breath. That was weird. One more for cancer, please. 
dangerous woman. All right, Cancer. Uh, so this person, they could have somebody that's got kind of a stronghold over them with the strengths coming out. Ooh, yeah, Leo energy. Dang one, and that's something's got them stuck, right? Pisces energy. This this person's got a feminine uh, watching over them, I believe. What else? Um, Aquarius. She could be an Aquarius or a Leo or a Pisces. King of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. She could. Ooh. Okay, so. This person could be, this person could also be, um, there's a lot of matches in here. So there's king and queen of wands, king and queen of swords, king and queen of pentacles. So there's either a marriage in here or there's going to be one. <laughs> okay, there's just too many matches in here of energies. Okay, so somebody could have been dealing with uh, someone who was kind of had narcissistic tendencies, possibly, and they had to go within here to do some healing. The Hermit, Virgo energy, the Lovers, yeah, they made a choice. They chose themselves. Gemini energy, they, yeah, this is looking like somebody had to heal from some kind of a narcissistic uh, situation. Somebody, possibly this King of Swords, was keeping this person stuck. Uh, not necessarily intentionally, but that was the way things were going. So this person had to go within. They made a choice to go within. The lovers represents a choice. Also Gemini. But they made the choice to go within and start healing themselves, okay? And gain the strength to end this cycle. 22 minutes on the clock. That's beautiful, Cancer, okay? The three of swords, you could have, there could have been uh, third party situations going on here, but I really feel like with this three of swords, death, Scorpio energy, that's nine of swords, you really um, went through a dark night of the soul. 93 or 39 could be significant, but you really went through a dark night of the soul and you came out on the other side as this sun, like uh, Leo energy, but trying to be happy within yourself and that's that's what we all need to do be happy within ourselves and not like waiting on somebody to come back all this stuff about waiting on somebody to come back no that's not what spirit wants for you gemini virgo energy spirit the most high whatever you resonate with um god could you know god is a woman whatever you resonate with the universe wants you to be happy within yourself and celebrating and appreciating life every day and not being in, stuck in this heartbroken energy. And you realize that and decide to start loving yourself. That's beautiful. You cleared up a lot of like childhood trauma, I feel like here with this dirt down here in the water. Like it was a lot of things that you had to heal. This is your energy all up in here. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy. Yeah. You got closer with your child here, I feel like. And now, now it's like you've got all these choices. 79 or 97 could be significant, but you're happy now, alone, but happy. And now you've got all these choices coming in. Of course you do. Okay. Yeah. But definitely use your discernment because there's... Let me show you what I'm saying, okay? You're very abundant with this Ten of Pentacles here. And there, people will try to trap you with this Eight of Swords energy here, okay? you. This is the wild card. You are a badass being full of life, love, and possibilities. People will try to take from you with this Seven of Swords. Lie to you. Um, Libra energy here. The Knight of Wands. Wait a minute. I thought... Oh... Both of these Ten of Pentacles have got a dog in them. Or dogs in them. I just noticed that. Okay, but yeah. You definitely had a family with this person. There's definitely going to be some competition coming in here. Because I feel like this one person hasn't fully left the situation. And there's someone else trying to come in. So, all right. Okay, Cancer, be careful with that. If you need a personal, 
um, email me at lucaredd44 at icloud.com. It'll be in the description box, all that information. Thank you, guys. Pisces will be next.